Greetings all, Mujin here. This will be uh, basics on fishing in Throne and Liberties. First of all, you'll obviously need a fishing pool and bait, both of which you can acquire at uh, various vendors. I believe the bait is from uh, the basic bait you can actually find out in the wild by harvesting certain plants, uh, plant material. But the uh, Probably the easiest way to do it is get it from contract coins. It's uh, fairly cheap from the contract vendor. But uh, anyhow, on with the show. We're going to cast our line. This is going to be all for keyboard and mouse. That's all how I play my games. Keyboard and mouse. So we're going to hit that F key. It's going to cast it out. And now we're going to wait. You're going to get an indicator and it's going to tell you to hit the Q key. Now, if you miss it, it's not its not going to be detrimental. Now, what you want to do is try to keep this light here green, and you want to pull against where it's swimming towards. This will wear the fish out. And if you do that, you should be able to catch a fish. So we'll go through that again. Cast our line. We're going to wait. Going to hit the Q key if it pops up. If you miss it, it's not a big deal. It does help. So now we're going to try to pull against it. We don't want to completely drain our green line. We're trying to drain the fish line here. And you can see this little indicator. That determines... Um, I believe it determines that you get a better chance at random fish. I'm not exactly sure how it all works out, but the uh, bigger that... Oops, so you can see I messed up. So it's not a huge deal, but it does slow us down a little bit. So you can see this little indicator growing a little bit. But it's not always guaranteed you'll get a... A big fish. You can pretty much cast into any body of water as long as you got this blue indicator. If it's red, you can't cast. If it's blue, you can. So now we're again we're gonna wait. Try to hit that button. So even if we if I, here, I'll show you. Even if it does get into the red, you can kind of pull it back. But even if it gets into there, you still have a chance. You're going to have a higher chance of failure. But uh, there are times when you can get a fish out of it, even if your um, indicator is red. Just be aware that your chance of failure is higher if you're in the red and you drain... Especially if you drain your stamina completely. So, try to keep pulling against where it's going, because it'll drain the fish's uh, stamina bar faster. Again, you don't want to completely drain your stamina. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice fish. So yeah, that's the um, basics on fishing. If you uh, practice this, you should be able to catch a fish almost every time you cast. Just be aware of your stamina bar. Again, don't drain your stamina bar completely, because that's when you're going to have a higher chance of failure. And you always want to pull against. There you can see it was red and I still got a fish out of it. Anyhow, that's all I got for today. Hope you find this video helpful and uh, keep on fishing. Bye for now.